Hello there and welcome to my channel. If you don't know me, my name is Karande and if you know me, then welcome back. Today, today's video, I'm just going to give you a few helpful tips if you've been thinking you're psychic or have any clear senses or anything like that. Because honestly, my whole life I knew it was something, but I didn't realize what it was until I got older. And I struggled my whole life because I didn't know what was going on. So I just want to help somebody else since I just started to realize more of what I need to realize so I can then take that information to build upon if that makes sense so if you think you're psychic or you think you have you know not supernatural but extraordinary abilities then continue watching so the first sign honestly it starts when you're a kid I would say everybody has psychic abilities but not everybody knows how to tap into them which is a lot of people's problems but as a child we're more sensitive to that type of stuff so when I was a kid, personally, I had so many experiences that I just thought I was haunted. I, thought, I really thought I was haunted, but when I think back on it, like I saw a ghost, which is one of the Claire's, clairvoyant, of course, The Sixth Sense is a good, well, not a good example, but it's a movie about clairvoyant and seeing ghosts. I saw, that was my first experience that I can remember, remember. And that's when I was around like eight or nine. I was around eight or nine. I saw a ghost and then of course I had like many different experiences. I used to hear a lot of things like I had a big thing. My family used to be so worried about this. I used to hear my mom call me all the time, like really very much there. Or at least I thought it was my mom and I would go to see and be like, Ma, you call me? She went, no. I sit down, I hear it again. I get up and ask again. She went, no, and she wasn't playing and nobody else heard it. It was just me. That's an example of Claire audience. It's, well, Claire hearing, it's mostly what you hear. And it's not supernatural, I would say, but I've learned that um, these abilities are just impressions left on your brain. It could be by a spirit, but it's never physically there. It's just your brain is being affected and you think you're hearing this or you think you're seeing this. So technically it's all in your brain, but at the same time, if a spirit wants you to see them, they won't physically be there, but they can... Uh, it's hard to explain. <laughs> I have a psychic book. Um, I'm actually just going to link it down below, but it helps... It explains everything way more in depth and it was only it was five below so it's only like five dollars but yes Claire audience it's not really you hearing things you are supposed to hear something you have an impression left inside some part of your brain which then stimulates the thought that it's coming from outside of you but is really inside I hope that makes sense all right so that's my childhood you know that's one two now that I'm an adult I've been seeing the future since I was a kid also. But when I was a teen, it got kind of stronger. So you notice you'll have visions or if you're clairvoyant, you will have visions. You'll see things like in your mind's eye, like in your dreams, in your sleep, while you're unconscious. And then you'll notice it will come to pass. And you're like, didn't I already, not deja vu technically, but you'll remember, like, I remember vividly seeing this in a dream, I remember daydreaming one day and I saw this but technically it wasn't a daydream it's hard to distinguish honestly unless you know exactly what you're looking for but daydreams and visions are kind of similar um, personally when I have visions I kind of like like you'll see my eyes I don't know I look like I'm zoned out and then I'll come back I'm like oh um <laughs> so there's that three I'm going by personal basis too I mean it's a bunch it's like a lot it's so many different types of um clairs I call them clairs but that's like the psychic abilities um they all start with claire like the word claire audience claire buoyance claire sentient claire cognizant that's a big one for me too claire cognizant is you just know stuff like i don't know how to explain it. you just know like somebody in my family let's just let's use this one when i was a kid it still happens strongly now but when i was a kid somebody in my family passed away nobody would tell me but for some reason nobody even looked sad i don't know how to explain it it was a person we weren't that close to personally, but we definitely knew this person. And I was just looking around at my family, like my granddad when he was still here, my mom, my sisters. My sisters didn't know either. But I was just like, hmm, uncle so-and-so must have died. I didn't know he was sick or anything because we didn't realize, well, we didn't know he had cancer or anything until after he passed away because they were hiding it from us. I had to be a little bit younger, 10 or under. But I vividly remember like uncle so-and-so passed away and then they told me and I remember shedding one exact tear 
I have this thing I always know when somebody, well, I usually know when somebody passes away in my family before it happens. Like, I don't know. Even, I don't know. I don't, I just know. <laughs> but that's what I'm coming to the terms with is this stuff is normal. Like, the reason I made my YouTube channel is to make people feel, well, open, included, and welcome. And honestly, this is a part of it. Like, I know some people are against this type of stuff, but it's not really witchery. I don't do any, like, I don't do anything witchery. I just literally sit there and think in my brain. That's, that's it. And everything I do is for the greater good. Like, I'm trying to help people out. So, yes, if you're uncomfortable with having these abilities, honestly, I fought it for my whole life. I was uncomfortable my whole life. And I knew, but I didn't want to admit it. Like, I knew something was different because I would my family knew my whole life too I would say stuff it would come true I would say I had this dream it would come true they all it's basically documented by my memories their memories some stuff is probably documented on paper too like I go back to something I wrote down I'm like oh gosh this literally happened not too long after this I'm just saying we all have these abilities but I would say for um empathy there's clear empath but there's also clear sentience now, they're two different things, but they're kind of, not similar, but they're both um, emotions, feeling in general. Clairsentient, I'm both. Everybody has all the clairs, but people can not tap into certain ones, or some are just stronger than the others naturally. But clair empathy, I would say, is more, you know how people are feeling, or you can feel their physical pain. I have, I feel their, I have both. I hang around somebody that's in a bad mood, even though they're not showing it. I keep questioning them, questioning them. Then later on, they wind up telling me, yeah, blah, 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 this happened. I was feeling kind of bad. I just didn't want to bother you. Like, I already knew. You could have just said it. I was asking you for a reason because I knew. <laughs> and then the um, physical feeling part. Um, my, um, well, I'm using this example. It happened before with other people too. But my boyfriend kept having a bad, bad back pain. I would have to rub it and stuff because it was that bad. But for some reason, after like a day of him having it, I woke up the next day with the same exact pain in the same exact spot. We were just walking around like old people because <laughs> we were just like, oh my gosh, why are, we, why are we having the same pain? That was just weird. But that's clear empathy. And then I would say clear sentience. It's just the vibes. Like you ever meet somebody and you immediately know they're evil or something or anything like that? It's the vibes are off. <laughs> and like you'll meet somebody and you'll know they're like an angel. And then... It's just vibes but those are four signs that you have some of the clears it's many clears i can make more videos but that's the basics and i just thank you for watching please like and subscribe and i'll see you in my next one